Hello. I haven't posted a Grace video this patch, so here it is. You know, he got nerfed 30% on first ability, but it doesn't really matter too much. I'll show you in this gameplay, he's still the same as always. It's a bit of a hit to his early jungle clear, but not too significant. So yeah, the build, nothing changed. You go Black Cleaver against hard matchups or against Bruisers. If they have like Lee Sin jungle, Kha'Zix jungle, you rush Black Cleaver first item so they don't one-shot you. If they're really squishy, you can start a Bloodthirster. I don't really like Storm Razor on Grizz anymore, I'm not a fan of it. I feel like the other items are just better, I eat spikes really hard on him. If you want to go full crit, you can go Storm Razor instead of uh, Black Cleaver. But I think Black Cleaver is just a really strong item on him overall. You stack the passive really fast, the HP helps you a lot. Has many benefits. Yeah, after that, uh, more to reminder, you need Armor Pen and Sarida is not really that useful on Graves. We can also go Death Dance somewhere in the build if you want it instead of GA, but I think GA is better, to be honest. As always, you can fit like Mo if you if you have trouble against heavy AP champs, against like Gragas or something, Echo, you do need Mo or they will just pop you. But yeah, not too many options. Lethality Graves with Yomus, I don't like it, I'm not a fan of it. Some people do enjoy it, but I think Grit is just still much better. The runes, nothing changed here as well. Conquer, Brutal... Um, oh yeah, Nullifying Orb, it's really good on him because you buy a lot of AD. It saves you a lot. And I actually play Nimbus Cloak now, it feels really good. You can still go Pathfinder if you want, there's nothing wrong with it. But the uh, Nimbus Cloak with the movement seed whenever you smite it helps you kite much better. Especially since I usually just go red smite and I don't have the movement speed from blue smite. Also when you flash you zoom zoom pretty fast for 2 seconds so yeah, overall pretty good. But yeah, a quick update on the build, nothing changed basically. Gameplay, I was playing with Doom, I think this was like... Two days ago, he was streaming, we were chilling. He got auto field mid on Katarina, happens. We're against the duo, I guess. Yep, the Lucian and Shen. I was thinking if I should start first skill still or third skill. I haven't actually tested which one is faster. Maybe third skill is faster again now. Need to check in practice to actually do it after I record this video. I actually didn't ward the uh, blue buff, I decided to ward in mid. We're up against the Riven, she most likely won't invade our blue anyway. I just want to give uh, Doom some vision around mid lane. And Trace is looking for something early. Yeah, I saw first skill. You will see the clear is actually a bit slower now. You finish like uh, after crab spawns or around that time. Maybe if you clear better, you will get it in time, but we will see. Yeah, we're against the Riven. As I said, Riven is really popular right now. I think Grace can do well into her as long as she doesn't snowball. It's really hard if she rushes test and second though, because you will do no damage to her until you get 3-4 items. You really need to scale a bit against test and champions as Graves. I decided to do small trucks, I mean to skip small trucks, just to have faster tempo on the map. This is uh, not so common anymore, but before we used to do it a lot in jungle. You lose a bit of golden XP, but you still hit level 3 on uh, on your raptors, it all depends on what you want to do. I finish clearing 110, I look both, I see they're fighting a lot, maybe we can pick up something. My Jinx is AFK under tower, I don't know why. I flash in for the trash. The trash is 1 HP, he gets out. I dodge the hook. I'm <laughs> I don't know man, my Jinx is a fucking AFK minion. He has flash barrier, everything. He just lets me die. Really great start for this game, I guess. We could kill both of them easily if Jinx just walked up and auto attacked them once, but it is what it is. He prefers to stay AFK under tower. I'm a bit tilted already. We saw Riven is topside, she's most likely in our blue buff. Invading. Yep, she is here. I do get the blue. And we force him out. Maybe our Katarina can clean up, we decide to chase. The Riven flashes out, but I think we still catch him. Yep, we do. He goes to me, beautiful. 
the Vigar lays to my red buff. The Shen is roaming mid, but I hit level 5, I smite the Shen, and I'm just really strong here. I could probably kill a boat if I played better. If I use first ability, then ult, I would kill Thresh as well. But yeah, we're <laughs> we're back in the game, just well, just like that. Three kills, we got our blue as well, we're super strong. We see Riven is back for bot crab, I don't have a smite, so I decide to not contest, I just ping and hope my bot lane doesn't die to a level 3 Riven gank with no flash. And we go back to farming. But yeah, it's a huge start. It's gonna be huge for me. I will scale really hard now. I almost have Cleaver in base soon. As I said against the Destin champions and bruisers in general, you need to go Cleaver first. If you go BT, you are too squishy against them. Against Assassins as well, actually, but yep. Yeah. We look to take crab here if I can and then base. We see the three people mid, but they don't rotate up to me, so I'm fine. Take the ward, we finish the scuttle. I got no time I actually decided to not reset. I know Riven is somewhere on Raptors. She decides to instantly ult, I just dash out. I just want to annoy him, I go back in look for him, but he probably went like frogs. So I decide to just keep going, I know he has no ultimate, we see he pulled his red, so he's on frogs for sure. I can uh, do this because I, I fucked up here. <laughs> I'm just pressing random buttons. I auto the plant, but yeah, it's fine. The Shen rotates gets out as well. I'm just pressuring him, like he can't do much against me. If he wastes, if he wasted his ultimate, Riven is not that big of an issue for Graves. You just uh, you start the ability when he is dashing in and kite him pretty well. I guess their team, team comp you would usually go blue smite, but I just really like to play red smite, so. Here I was thinking if we can force top tower because it's 4 minutes and we know Riven was pretty pretty low, he based or took red buff and this Shen can't do much against me and Darius, he will die if he tries to walk up we just go for the tower it's a huge wave that Shen is losing we see Riven is about on Drake, we chill, we take this, we go Herald I have 3k gold Sometimes it's fine to stay on the map if you have a lot of gold, depends on the situation, you have to... You have to take the decision if it's worth it or not, but yeah, we get the top tower, we get the herald. It's alright, we base. They get infernal, who cares? I'm super strong, I get my mercs, mini mercs against them, they have trash Vagar and I don't have titan in runes, so... Can't play without mercs against them, also Shen taunt, or even stuns, you know, there's a lot of stuff. Kiao will keep scaling. It's 4 to 8, we are actually not doing that great, our bot lane got stomped really hard, they lost tower. Yes, our Jinx kept staying AFK, who knows. I go to the Katarina so she can jump on me away from the Lucian. I just push mid, I dodge the hook, I go farm. But I always keep farming as Graves, it's really important to get to your items. Even if one of your monkeys die in their lane, there's not much you can do to help them usually. Just try to get your items and carry late game. Graves has insane 1v9 potential after 2-3 items. I shall demonstrate it for you soon. Our trash. Okay, our Dar is face check trash, but it's fine. We can actually look to go in here, but. We need to kite back the Riven. The Riven messed up, she is dead. You can always press your ultimate against CC. It will still go through, as you saw with the knock up from Riven. I still uh, get my uh, pushback. The Lucian ults the mid wave. He should be dead for this, I don't know how he can, he can just like uh, dash like this in front of me, my team is sleeping. 
yeah, we take mid tower with the Herald, it's really good. I know Vega is somewhere here bot side, he was pushing and moving up and we find him. But it's kind of risky to go for the 1v1, I just take the crab and go bot wave. I ping my Jinx to go bot because she is clueless on how to play this game, she's just running around, staying AFK. Hectic rugs, just farming, farming, farming. I'm a rice farmer. Ace, we almost have VT. Our Darius killed the Shen 1v1, solo bolo. Pretty well played. What are you playing at? We see they are trying to dive top, we will rotate to help. And they decide to back out. I'm just looking around, we see Riven to call her top camps, there's nothing to invade. They will all rotate bots, so I'll just push mid fast if I can. Need to be careful with Trash Lucian, they'll try to run me down. I get hit by the hook, but it's uh, baiting. My team is here, they don't take the bait, probably it's worded. We just go back to farming. You see Lucian has even more gold than me. I'm ahead of Riven, but Lucian is super fed. And he has trash, so it's a bit hard for me to get close to him unless uh, he fucks up or he goes too aggressive. We farm, we have our B team base. We just decide to recall for it, Herald is in 30. I just have to make sure we can focus Lucian. We have to keep in mind they have Shen ultimate as well. It's not that simple to play. But I can trust Doom to play with me, so it's not that big of a problem actually. You see Vega is just stacking bots, chilling farming, so we should have a free herald here. Take my blue real quick. We start the herald, we see Vega is rotating, but we should be able to take it in time. We do get the herald. I'm looking for the fight, but I see Vegar is alone on the flank behind, so I just decide to turn for the Vegar. I fucked up my first ability though, unlucky. I just run him down, he flashed. I flash over his cage, I just kill him. Shen and Lucian are trying to go for me. But I play it really well, I focus the Lucian. I have the BT life still, I'm really strong. I heal a lot. We get the Shen as well and... Uh, And guess what? This Graves is a bit of a problem now. Well, I am kind of big. What can I say? Drake is coming up. We should go Drake, I don't know where I'm going. I'm dizzy as fuck. I'm on that adrenaline rush, you know, killing everyone. The dopamine. What are you playing at? Yeah, we'll push mid first so we, no one will take mid power while we're doing Drake. It happens way too often, you know where he knows. We just started Drake, I'm so strong I don't think anyone would do anything to me at this point. Finish the Drake. I have I in base, but we see Trash is kinda in thing face checking. No flash for the Veigar, we can dive this. No one in my team has boss to go first, so I will go first I guess. We clean them up, we will lose mid for this, but it's alright. Two kills but tower Drake. You want to keep pushing tier 2. I'm just uh, taking this jump and basic defend mid. I would stay for blue normally, but I don't know. I just decided to base. I would have went Proto Belt here to be honest. Maybe I'll buy it later. I don't remember if I bought it or not. But Proto Belt is really good against their team. No one can really dive onto me other than Riven. Clear out the top lane. What are you playing at? The team is a bit of work extended on bot lane. I hope they base and they do. Nicely done. Nice, nice. That Riven seems a bit tilted, not gonna lie. But we're chilling. I'm still farming for my four items. Don't really care about what anyone else is doing. 
Try to look for the Riven mid, we see she pressed uh, her first ability, but it's kinda deep, the trash is rotating. I get collapse here, but I'm kiting back really well. We get out. Nice first ability check, XD. Maybe if Shen ulted, Shen ulted now. We turn back to mid lane. He's going in. We kite around a bit. We decide to dash in. We have to be really careful with trash hook, but we are kinda winning. The big guy flash shoots me, I flash out his Q, his first ability, and I don't die, I survive. The 150, <laughs> the minion Vigar, 150 cash money. Nice dash into the wall, Malphite emoji. Ooh, I spot a juicy control ward. I must take it. Plus 30 gold, come to Papa. Okay, we got it. We see an angry Riven is trying to chase us down. He's coming, he's emotional player. Oh my god, he's flashing over the wall! He Okay. Okay, the outplay. Okay, we blast him, bro! Get blasted, son. You mad, bro? Problem. Problem, Riven. Jungle deep. What can I say? I'm just a build different. Now, the Lucian uh, wants a piece of me. He's trying to, trying to chase me down, but I'm chilling. I'm gonna go base. I proved myself to be the superior human the superior being over this uh, even dirty abuser but yeah our team somehow they all died so we'll just have to defend mid and uh, bot tier 2 if we can have to be really careful with shen and fresh hook i get hit by the hook but he won't take it to deep i want to play this but i have to be really careful i think i will die if i get shen taunted I need to, need to pay attention to the movement. Yeah, they decide to back off. We lost bot tier 2, but it's not that big of a deal. I'm 15k gold to Graves. Giga chat. Shouldn't be possible to lose this game unless my whole team uh, ints it. The Lucian is still an issue. He has a lot of gold. And he has a good peel from Trash and Shen. If the Vegar can press his cage properly one time, I think we will lose the team fight, but it's alright. I know Trash Lucian are there, I just smoke screen in case they're camping. Get the blue, I'll push top fast. I really want to get my Guardian Angel, but I don't think I'll have time to farm it. Jay is much better than Destance this game, especially since they have a lot of heavy bursts like Vagar. There's nothing much I can buy to counter it even with Mo. He will still pop me once he gets items. I'm just looking for something, but it's hard. Our Jinx is farming both. They go in on the Katarina. Nice first ability. I know I have this habit to throw it into the wall. It's my fetish. Trying to chase down the Vagar. He stays in my first ability for some reason, I don't know why. <laughs> he just blasts him again. 125 gold, another cannon minion in my pocket. But yeah, we just go Drake. Vegar is dead, Shelly stop pushing, chilling. Oh, never mind, I dash off her. I get exhausted, the Riven, emotional again. Trying to look for me. I just cut it out, I flash over the wall, she's down. I have to be, be careful with the Lucian, I just go all in on him. It's the only problem. And we just win the fight. What is there left to say? I don't know how Shen died, did he just loot in? I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> but yeah, that's the GG. The nice 1v9. I mean, Doom played really well as well. It helped me out a lot. Oh man. What a game. What a performance. With a nerfed champion, by the way. 100% of course, well deserved. Big thumbs up. Let's see the damage, 24k, I thought I did more to be honest. But yeah. That's it for the game. Drop a like for the insane 1v9. For the insane outplay on this uh, Riven. And thanks for watching.